And I'm going to show you some of the tools that you'll be able to use when you're working on a worksheet in Kami. So the first set of tools, actually what we'll do is we're going to, there's an arrow down here that will allow you to expand and you can see what everything is named on the side. Um, it's right now it's covered up by my recording thing here, but um, there's a double arrow down there for you. So this arrow means select. Um, the first tool you're going to use is called Markup, and this will um, be a text highlighter. It's got a box highlighter, a strike through tool, and an underline tool. So the first one, you'll select a text highlighter tool, and you're going to highlight the text that you want highlighted. You can pick different colors um, when you want to do these highlights. And after you've done the highlight, you can um, just hover over where you've highlighted, and then you can um, change colors afterwards if you wish. The next tool is the box highlighter, and that's going to create a big highlighted box around whatever it is that you wish to highlight. I'm going to change color again. Uh, we're going to do a strike through. This is um, if you're going to do any um, edits on here like if you do a group edit for English or something, um, you would select what you want to do a strike through and it puts a line through it for you. And then we have the underline tool. I'm going to do, let's see, I'll try blue underline and I'm going to underline all those words right there. So that's as easy as that. Um, you can change all the colors. Even after the fact, you can change the colors. All right, moving on to the comment tool. Let's say you have a story to read and you need to make a comment. You're going to click on the comment box. Um, you can make the dot for the comment different colors. And then you're going to click near where you want to write your comment. Um, you can see the dot is purple, but I'm writing my comment over here. Um, let's see, my comment dot is purple. And then we're done with that. Um, the next box is, or the next tool is going to be a text box. And you can um, use this to answer questions or write, you know, and type anywhere you wish. So what is your favorite thing to do when you're not in school? You're going to put a text box. You're just going to click and then you can say, um, I love to read. And we can you can change your colors after that. So if you select all your words, you can change the, the color. You can bold it. You can make it bigger. Um, three point. You can make it wider like that. Um, so you can play around with some of these tools here. You have um, uh, subscript and superscript capabilities. You can use numbering. We can do bullets. You can do indents. Um, you can even, you know, center your, your wording. Um, and you can even add a hyperlink, um, which is kind of cool. That's actually new this year. All right. So the next tool that you'll be using is a drawing tool. Uh, the drawing tool lets you um, like draw freehand. So for this one, I would recommend using your finger or if you have a stylus, uh, but let's pick, let's pick a pretty nice color and I'm going to write my name, not the neatest, but you can see how you can write freehand there. And then we have a shapes tool. Um, they give you three different shapes and then they give you a line. Um, we can change the, the thickness of the lines that our shapes have. So we're going to draw a square. Come on. There we go. Um, let's do green circle. I'm going to change that. So it'll be like that. The next one here, let's do a triangle. We will change it to very thin green triangle. And then the for the line, um, that'll just draw a straight line for you. Okay, the last tool is the eraser. Um, and it will erase, you know, the whole 
the whole object that you have there. Um, that, so that's a quick way to get rid of whatever you have um, written on there. And those are the basic tools that we'll be using in Kami.